Hello. Hi. We're in Greece. Me and my brother Steve. We're in Thessaloniki. Thessaloniki. And we've got to get to Litochoro, which is about 100 miles away. We have no idea what we're doing. Probably going to try getting buses. Should be an adventure. We're here to climb Mount Olympus, but we don't start that till tomorrow. So we've got all day to get to where we're going. <laughs> we're going this way to get a drink. So we'll catch up with you when we know what's going on. But the sun is shining. Life is good. So the first leg of our journey is to get to Macedonia bus station. We just bought some tickets. They were only cheap, weren't they? The bus comes in 15 minutes and then we'll worry about the next section, which is the longest bit. But yeah, three bus rides. We should do it. It's an adventure, isn't it? Three. Three bus rides. Yeah, I know. So the plan is, I think, to get as far as we can. As soon as he starts crying and whining, I'll get us a taxi. Is that all right? All right. All right. So, the second leg of our journey sorted. We're going to Caterini and then Litachoro. It's the same bus. Seriously, everyone here, how nice are they? Lovely. Everyone is so helpful. I love Greece so far, it's brilliant. It's all good, we're on the bus. In total, this has cost us 18 euros one way. And the transfer was going to be 140, so definitely the right way to go. And it's more exciting and more interesting. First glimpse. That must be it. It's in the clouds, though. made it. Little Choro. It's three o'clock. We were up at 2 a.m. It's one o'clock in the afternoon our time, isn't it? British time. Yeah. So I'm tired. I think we're just going to get something to eat and then go and check in. Don't <laughs> Go and check in and then we'll uh, come back out. I want to see if I can see Olympus. Mount Olympus. I'm sure that was it on the way in, do you? It must be. It was in the clouds, wasn't it? But we, we'll eat. Eat throw a ball behind us or drink a beer oh yeah okay. yeah and then check in yeah and then we're gonna come out and explore this evening yeah, yeah. when in Greece what was it called Giro. 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 what's it like bro what's the dirt in awesome. it is like a kebab isn't it yeah mm. it's like a kebab in a pancake <laughs> this is us this is us Now this will do. I wonder if we can get these beds further apart, bro. I'm thinking yours should be on the balcony. Don't, don't, don't break it. Don't break it. Oh, it's romantic, isn't it? Yeah, this is nice. Oh, wow. That might be Mount Olympus up there. I need to uh, identify it. But first I'm gonna unpack, or I mean, when I say unpack, unpack and have a nap I'm an old man 50 year old I need my naps cheers we're just um, looking at the schedule so we're in Litichoro tomorrow we're being taken to Prionia so it's a drive to get there which is at 1100 meters and then we're hiking up a thousand meters six kilometers to Spilos Agapitos which is a refuge where we're staying for the night and then the day after we reach the peak which is another four kilometers yeah. and we're hitting the Mitikas summit and that's 2,900 meters so another 800 meters I think it seems like it's going to be a leisurely pace 
But it should be good fun, shouldn't it? Yeah, I think so. Mount Olympus. It's obviously going to be trickier than we think it's going to be because it sounds not so much, doesn't it? But something will come along and yeah. change all that. Well, the last bit of it is a scramble. We've got ropes and helmets. You know this, yeah? Mm -hmm. Good. So yeah, yeah it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a tricky, a tricky summit. It's supposed to be. I had to keep that bit to myself. Yeah. Yeah, I can tell Steph about it. Really? Yeah. Oh, she'll mention helmets and scrambling ropes. She'll hate that, won't she? Yeah. yeah. She'll, she'll find out when this video comes out. So. So she will. Yeah. Do you want me to put the video out if you fall to your death? Oh, definitely. Yeah. And if you can get some footage of that, even better. Probably get me views. Yeah. If that's what we're here for. That's what we're here for. Yeah, for your that's what I'm here your for. life for views would give your life meaning. It would. Of which it has none now. <laughs> of, which, of which it has none now. Yeah. <laughs> that's what younger brothers are for, isn't it? I'll mourn you. One thing to add: Mount Olympus, if you didn't know, is the highest mountain in Greece. That's, so that's where all the Greek gods used to oh, the go Greek gods. Their thing. Godly. Sort yeah, of, the I don't gods. think they were nice, were they? All the gods, yeah, yeah. like Zeus and um, uh, all, all the gods, you know, Odin, Odin, Odin yeah. yeah, and Athena, uh, the god of gift cards, Loki, Loki, Thor, yeah, yeah and um, uh, Captain America. America. <laughs> <laughs> He'll be up there, of course, he will, yeah, <laughs> Captain America. <laughs> so time to go back to the room half past nine which is late enough since we've been up since two so yeah and then we'll see you in the morning yeah bright and early there's loads of cats around here for some reason that's true there are lots of cats around here yeah anything else you'd like to add um there's a dog over there as well yeah brilliant nice view we're gonna go and get a coffee, hang around till two o'clock when we start this walk. But what a day, absolutely perfect. I think it's gonna get hot, but I can live with that. We're at Pioneer, ready to start our walk. Beautiful day, nice and cool as well up here. So lucky, the guide said it's unusual for it not to be raining this time of year, so. Just another bit of good fortune. third of the way up for today. I'm just told there's 1,500 different species of wildflower here and 12 are endemic so can only be found here but there's bears, lynx. So yes I'll update you when we get a bit further on. It's a bit awkward filming because we're in a group and as you know I don't like filming in groups. It's not really very good when you're a YouTuber which is what I am. <laughs> That's where we're headed. And it does look a long way up. We're about an hour from the refuge now. It's been a nice walk, very peaceful up here. Looking forward to for some hot food and of course a beer to sit up there and watch the sunset. It's gonna be a good evening. Mitikas, that's where we're going tomorrow. The summit, it's the middle thing, which Mitikas means needle by all accounts. Looks pretty impressive, doesn't it? Hmm. I mean, the reason we're doing a guided walk anyways, there's 55 peaks on Mount Olympus. Mitikas is the highest, so it's the official summit. And there is some technical climbing. 
So we've been given helmets and harnesses. I don't know what the deal is. I guess there's ropes and things. Now, we've never done anything like that before, have we? Nope. So in order to get to the peak safely, we've decided to go guided and then see what it's like. It better be difficult. If it's easy, you know, we're up there with harnesses and ropes and helmets and then there's little kids walking past us. <laughs> they will be, won't they? Yeah. Not old folks. That's the deal anyway, but yeah, what a beautiful little spot. The group we're in is okay, it's only eight people. And the refuge is over there somewhere, so we're not far from that, so... So far, so good. This tree is 600 years old, one of the oldest trees on Mount Olympus. And there's one somewhere that's a thousand years old in this national park, which is one of the oldest in Europe. That is a good view. See the sea. Can you? Yeah, I think that big blue thing. I think that's some more sky in it. <laughs> I think it's a ski. I do. Mm. Do you? <laughs> yeah. Beer. We're at the hostel. Cool place, very busy. Can I have some spaghetti in a minute? I've just seen someone else eating it and it looks awesome. Huge portions and I am starving. No showers or anything here, but that's fine. I'm used to that. I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna drink and then get an early night. Get up about six in the morning. We've got to be ready to go by eight. The only downside is because it's a, an organized sort of tour, I just, I haven't got over this whole um, filming when people are around. I don't mind doing it, but you know, you can't be sure that people want to be in these films. And it has been suggested I could ask them and, you know, and see, but then I'm putting people in a position where they have to say no. And I don't want to do that. So it's never going to change. I'm never going to. I'm never going to just film people um, unless I know them well enough that I know they don't mind. So there we go. See you tomorrow. Morning. It's early. We have coffee. Today we summit Mount Olympus. Tomorrow we die. Eight o'clock and we're off. That little formation over there is called the Eagle. We're close to the ridge, just having a quick break. And then once we get on the ridge, we walk along, get to the summit, summit, Mitikas. And then there's a hostel right on the ridge. I can see it over there, over there. And we can stop there for lunch. There's Mitikas, the peak. This is where we are now, is as high as you can get without equipment. And then you use equipment now to get the top there, which I've never done. So helmets, harnesses. Excited to see how this works out. If you go, I go. Go. Cramp break, bro. <laughs> Cramp break. Yeah. This is a story to tell. Yeah, it is, isn't it? How about you say that thing, leave me behind, guys. I'm just yeah. going to slow you down. Yeah.
How are you finding it, bro? Walking apart. Loving it, I have to say. After one hour of doing it, it is my favorite thing in the world. <laughs> really? I'm gonna be, yeah, I'm gonna be doing this all the time, honestly. It is absolutely awesome, I love it. I'm gonna have to find out these scrambles, find out what class this one is. Absolutely love it. There's the other party behind us. Final push to the peak. You didn't back about. <laughs> we made it. Highest mountain in Greece. We're at 2,918 meters. And I tell you, the views up here are incredible, aren't they? And that was way more technical than I thought, yeah? Yeah. But way more fun than I thought. Anyway, forgot. we're going down somewhere over there now. And then we go over that plateau and there's a refuge. I can see it, if you can see it in the distance. That's where we're going to stop. Yeah, we're going down there and we're going to stop there for lunch. So, that's good. <laughs> now to go down. This is mental. <laughs> I'm going to confess, this is mental. Can't believe we just came down there. <laughs> right now, we're going to head to the highest church in Greece and onto a refuge where we're going to stop to get a drink. I'm going to eat my extremely hot, squished sandwich, but it's still going to be good. So, before I forget, I just want to say. There's no way I could have done that without um, the guide. No way I would have wanted to do it. And it wouldn't have been safe without the equipment. So I'm glad we did do a guided tour for this one. The throne of Zeus. How cool is that? Wow, this is cool. Look at this for a view. So, we're going up that hill to the church and then over to that hostel over there. Oh, come on, you ducked. <laughs> So this is the grave of the man who founded this hostel, refuge, and he died from a fall in the, where we just climbed down in 1964. Oh, the highest chapel in the beacons. Also, thought to be an old temple of Apollo, which is very cool. I wonder if people still use it. It's full of little um, artifacts.
So here we are. This is not our hostel, but it's two hours walk from our one. And I think we're going to end the video here because yeah. it's just going to be walking back through forests and woodlands and everything. You've seen all that. This um, refuge, by the way, was a holiday home for King Paul. We've just been told. I don't know when, but it was donated to the National Park by the Royal Family. So that's hmm. pretty cool. And behind us, behind us, behind us, yeah. we can see another view of Zeus's throne. Oh, yeah. So as I have a beer. God, he's a big fella, Zeus, wasn't he? He was. Well, he was a god, wasn't he? So as I drink my beer <laughs> <laughs> in the presence of Zeus's throne, I shall say thank you for watching. And I'll see you in the next video. And I apologise for this exposure. Yeah. Get a load of this. He just couldn't wait. Could Ladies. He? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching.